Hey, this is Rachel from The Life Facilitator, and I am sharing a super fun unboxing of the Hubman and Chub Girl Let's Travel collection. Um, and I am, oh my gosh, this is like the cutest collection ever. And I love travel collections. They're always a favorite of mine. And this, their designs are just absolutely adorable. And they have very thoughtfully put this whole kit together and I just can't wait to share it with you. So let's get into it. First off, it comes in a little luggage box. Come on now, that's so cute. I love this idea for, um, you know, if you wanted to put all of your, like all of your ephemera and bits and bobs from a trip all in one place, you could do it and put it in here. For me, I plan to use it for all of my travel related, um, accessories or embellishments, decorations, you know, stickers and papers and whatnot. I'm going to put them all in here so that I can have them all in one place. Um, so it has a little clasp and I just did my nails yesterday. So I'm a little, <laughs> I'm, I'm very hesitant with them anyway. All right, open it up. And we get a little note. Look at that. How cute is that? Um, about your order. Thanks for the order. Very cute. And then um, when you open the kit, it has a um, acrylic shape shaker charm. Super cute. You can put that on like your luggage or on a backpack or whatnot. Super cute. Key ring. You get another. You get a magnetic name tag. This would be great to put on a luggage a bag so that you don't lose your bag. And oh my gosh, how cute! You get some vinyl stickers, and I will. I'll take them out when I do the actual journal setup. You get some super cute planning stickers and they're small enough that you could use them on basically in any planner so you get these ones your little itinerary your packing flight and sort of memories yeah super cute and then and guys let's talk about this this tissue paper it's got little planners on it oh my gosh I love it <laughs> so cute I love it um, and then you also there is a mini planner kit and I will I'll open these when I do the planner the planning you get some more super fun stickers this one says let's catch a flight so some fun flight stickers this one's let's make memories I can never have enough like little cameras. I love the cameras so much and the little maps. Oh my gosh. Um, and then this is for trip planning. And then you get two journals. So these are, let me measure them. Oop. So these journals are see they are um, a5 I'm pretty sure these are roughly a5 maybe slightly smaller than a5 but right around a5 size so a really great size for traveling not too big not too small um, the paper is super nice it's like um, it's very thick I imagine stamping will be easy on this paper it's got a dot grid on it really nice very smooth paper and it is a I would say it's like a it's pretty well let's look at something white um, so it's cream ish but it's not the creamy kind of paper that like I don't know I I prefer white and so this is pretty close to white paper to me at least to my to my eye um, and look at the look at that how cute is that 
and then you get and you don't get one but you get two um and i am not sure how many pages are in this but it is small enough that you could easily use it for one trip um look at that love that um so you get two notebooks and then you get two rolls of washi this one has a map with gold foiling and the little airplanes flying around oh my gosh this one has the little uh, geotag and some like words this one says travel the world jet setting let's explore the world this would be super cute to like use with photos as like little captions um, and then you get this man this is such a good idea i was just thinking i'm about to go on a trip and it is always so nice to have like a just a bag for laundry or for shopping or for whatever it's soup this is super great um and it comes with the kit and i mean how much more fun is it that it is cute like I have tons of reusable bags, but like none I want to take with me on a trip that are this cute. And then so that you can travel with your supplies, you get a pouch. Look at this pouch. It has little pockets inside to put things in like pens. These journals also fit in the pocket um, it inside the little pouch and then you could get all your stickers bring your stickers along with you um, it's just a really nice size you could easily fit a few you know markers in there maybe some ink for stamping if you had some stamps you wanted to use super great love this idea I love that this kit is like um, it, it is all of the kit can fit in here that's such a good idea um, so this is this is the kit what comes in the let's travel collection and right now I'm going to um, do a setup of this journal for a upcoming trip that I am going on and I'm going to use items from the collection to set up my pages. So stick around for that. So as I was looking through the stickers, I noticed that there were several um, stickers that made perfect headers for the different lists and categories of pages that I would want in a travel journal. And so I wanted to start with a packing list. Now, I have a couple, I have put this page a few pages from the front because I have a couple of other pages I want to do um, that I don't need the stickers from the kit for. Um, but the first page that instantly came to mind of what I absolutely need for this uh, journal is a packing list. I have found it, it goes against every fiber in me to make a packing list because I just want to throw everything in a bag, but I have much more successful trips when it comes to the items that I need when I make a packing list. This, is, this isn't rocket science, but <laughs> um, it is very true. I have separated three sections of my packing list. Um, again, this just helps me not just write a long list and they get overwhelmed by the list. So I have my clothes items. Um, I'll have my like technology slash toiletry items and then personal items, which would include things like my passport, my wallet, um, any like travel journaling items I want, maybe a book, snacks, those sorts of things. Um, and yeah, I, I, this was so easy to put together thanks to these adorable stickers um, and on to the next one. So for the next spread, I am doing um, a 
list of my flights. I have several flights that I will be taking in order to do this trip. One of the flights will be to Chicago. Um, I'll stay with my parents for a few days and then fly to Tokyo. And then from Tokyo on the return trip, we have, um, we are not nonstop. And so, yeah, there's just quite a few little trip, little flights. And I do want to have them all in the same place because there's nothing more annoying than flipping back through my phone to try to find them. Yes, I can put them in my Apple wallet or, or whatnot, but it is really nice to see all of the flights all on this on one page. And frankly, when you have the cute stickers, you should use them. Um, so I have made this spread. I put the the arrival departure no departure arrival stickers not in the place that I intended to after thinking more about the spread. So I was able to pull them up pretty easily and make a section for, I'll, I will um, make several little rows for the different flights that I will be taking. And this is the benefit of a dot grid notebook um, is that it's so easy to make um, these different rows because you can just count out your um, dots. And I think I did like maybe four between the different lines. Um, and yeah, I just, I love this fact of a dot grid notebook. It just makes m making a clean spread so easy. And this paper is super beautiful and super easy to write on, especially with the brush pen that I just wrote date flight on. Um, now I won't be adding the, the, um, flights here. Um, I'll do that off camera. And then I had this large section at the bottom that was open. I could put some more information down there if I wanted to, but you know, I just got inspired to use some of these box stickers to add some deco to the bottom of the page. So I added, I add two box stickers and then I'm going to embellish the middle section, make a little like collage of stickers um, in the middle section. And it's just so cute and I love how it turned out and it just makes me really happy. This is probably my I don't often like thinking about flights, but I love this page so much that I will definitely be referring back to this page frequently because it's just so cute. Um, and I, the other thing too is like, you get so many stickers in this collection. I did, I do not have to worry about running out of stickers. I have so many left over. Um, it's just wonderful. So here is a look at, um, the spreads that I was able to make, uh, for now. I, I plan to do several more and I will be posting an after the pen on my Instagram once I return from my trip. Um, so I hope you enjoy this video. Please check out this collection. It is just wonderful. And yeah, I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.